Hey everybody, I'm Kate from Kate Creates and today we're making welcome mats. Things you're going to need today are a welcome mat, doesn't have to say welcome, mine is just plain brown, I got it for $10 at Target, sponge brushes, one for each color of paint that you're going to pick out, painter's tape, and acrylic paint, I have four colors. Last but not least, it wouldn't be Kate Creates if we didn't use paper plate. So step one is going to be putting tape on your mat in weird random geometrical patterns. I'm just going to be taking one strip, starting on one end, putting it all the way to the other end, and I'm going to do that in just a bunch of different directions. going to want to start painting. So go ahead and grab your paint bottles and squirt each color onto the paper plate so you have somewhere clean to work from. Then we're just going to dab our paintbrush in each color and paint the squares the color that you want them to be. Mine are going to be alternating between blues, whites, and yellows. Okay, so now that we've finished painting, what we want to do is take the tape off so you can see your beautiful work, and then we're just going to let it dry and put it outside your front door so you can welcome all your friends with your beautiful Korean artwork. Boom! Beautiful! So, oh my gosh. Take a look at that. It is so beautiful. It's gonna look so much different than the rest of my neighbors. I mean, they're saying welcome. Mine just says triangles. Or a crafter lives here. Or what if they watch this show and they're like, oh my god, my neighbor is Kate Greaves. So shout out to my cousin Danielle who shared this with me. I love the idea. This was so easy and I actually needed a welcome mat. So I'm not giving this away. A, because shipping would cost a fortune, and B, because these are my favorite colors. In case you didn't notice, they're the same colors as the coffee mug. So anyway, I just want to thank you guys for watching the show with me. I hope that you make your own welcome mats and that you take pictures of them and you hashtag Kate Creates and you hashtag DIY Wednesdays because that's what today is. Share them with all your friends. Subscribe to my channel, like my video because you did. Comment on it down below and tell me what you want to see us craft next. I know I said last week that we were going to have a segment with a jar where I pull out a random craft, but truth is I did not have time to make that jar this week. So that will be next week. And I also need a name for that jar. I'm thinking like Bernard or Chloe, but I'm not sure. So if you guys have a cool name for my awesome random craft jar, could you just like let me know in the comments below? Also, if you want to give me suggestions about stuff that will go in the jar, that'd be super cool. I mean like, wouldn't you be excited if one day I pulled out an idea and if that was you? I'd be pretty psyched. So anyway, like, comment, subscribe, share with your friends, make sure you're commenting on the Facebook videos and sharing all over the place. Don't forget to go comment on that Walking Dead video. Seriously, go comment on Facebook, go like it on Facebook, go comment on YouTube, and you're entered to win those coasters. I know, they're super cool and I like them, so you should like them. If you don't, I'm going to give them to my roommate because he loves The Walking Dead. Get on that. Ready, set, go. I will see you guys next week, and as always, bye guys!